Welcome to the Sepia Tones introductory video. I'm going to show you how using a Sepia Tones painting kit you can produce a really lovely oil painting based on a photograph. So let's have a look inside the kit. Firstly we supply you with all the paints and brushes that you need. The paints are high quality oil paints mixed to the colours that you'll need. Um, you have a template. This is what you'll do your painting on. You might not see the detail at the moment, we'll look at it closer later on. You have extra sheets which show you exactly where the colours are going to go. So I've taped my template to the inside of my CP Tones box lid. Um, I'm going to be using a tabletop easel, but you don't really need one of those. I will start painting from the top left down so that I don't smudge, smudge it. If you're left-handed, then you start painting over here and move down. Let's have a really close look at the painting kits. Don't panic, they look a lot harder than they are. If we look up here, we can see the coding and that shows you what paint you're going to use. So let's start painting. Okay, so I've been painting for about 10 minutes now. As you can see, I've got a little gap here and I can't see what the lettering is because it's very small. So that's where my extra sheets come in. I can compare and I can see that that's the gap and it's pink, so it's M. So, in it goes. So I've been working on this painting for about eight hours now. Um, 20 minutes here, 20 minutes there. It is addictive. You can sometimes spend up to two hours painting. It's really fun to do. Um, this painting is from our red range. If you look at our website, www.sepiatones.co.uk, you can see that we also produce uh, painting kits in the shades of grey and in sepia tones. So do take a look. You can also see other examples of paintings. I'm going to be working on this eye now. And because it's quite precise and because um, I want it to be nice and sharp, I'm going to use a new fresh brush with a sharp point. I just dip the brush into the tube. You don't need a palette because the colours are already mixed. Make sure that you get cover all the little blue lines and the gaps. In between colours you can just use a piece of kitchen roll and just wipe the brush, especially with the light colours. With the darker colours you may need to use thinners just to clean the brush out more thoroughly. One good tip is don't overload your brush. The paint will push the hairs apart if you put too much on. Just keep it on the tip and you'll keep a nice sharp point. working on the cheek, I've got this little area of M to do, I can just quickly plop that in. You can see that there's a line around this and it's fine if you don't want to blend it, but if you do, you want to blur those edges, just take the brush and just streak it across the edges like that. So there we have it, with a sepia tones painting kit we're confident anyone can produce an artwork to be really proud of. If you're not sure about it, take a look at the money back guarantee on the website. They make really nice gifts and a really nice treat for yourself. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. Bye bye.